Oh yeah, this is my 75 gallon sump. Uh, my other video, I'm just gonna show a little bit of an update on it. Um, I got a little bit of rock in there that I just took out of my display tank. This wasn't working. I would, uh, I set up myself quarantine tank, so any tangs and stuff I get. It's a 40 gallon, four foot. I got a heater in there. Just power head, circulate the water. So keep the keep the tanks in there about a week, three days. So make sure got all my uh, electrical switches, got all my water testing supplies. I got a filter just to buff the water, keep it clear. This is my Tunzi skimmer. Just clean that. I return from upstairs. Um, these are my brute, 44 gallon each uh, water containers. I do my water changes. I usually do uh, 44 gallons. I usually take 44 gallons out of my sump for uh, the water change. This is my Coralife uh, RODI filter. My sink that I just use for my water changes. I'm doing a, getting water mixed up there right now, 44 gallons. I got a uh, power head in there just mixing it up. The release do eight hours mixing the water. I'll post a water change there. I'm getting it mixed right now. Just a few more hours to mix to make sure it's completely dissolved. This guy here, he likes to eat all my hermit crabs and stuff. I don't know what's up with him, so he's got his own little aquarium down here in the basement. Nice having in the basement. At least anything wet, I got my sump over there. Do my water changes. This goes in that, and it's good. So, so that's my sump. And this is where I do my water changes and everything. Not to do anything upstairs. Thanks for checking it out.